Okay. Hey guys, this is Moritz for T3N. We are live from CES 2013 and we're with a kind of famous company uh, during the last month. It's called uh, Pebble, one of the most successful Kickstarter projects back in the last month. Um, and we're here with uh, Raul, who's um, telling us um, what's the state of the project right now. Where do you see Pebble right now? What's the news you brought for CES? So our big announcement uh, today at CES was that we're going to be shipping uh, to our backers on January 23rd. Okay, so that's so a final shipping date. You're sure? about that? That's the day we're going to start shipping. Okay, all right, cool. Absolutely. So how many of uh, how many products are you going to ship out in this days? Any any numbers? How many of the backers are going to receive their products? Uh, so we have about 85,000 units to ship out. Yeah. Um, it's not going to all happen instantly, of course. but over the course of the next uh, few weeks, starting from the 23rd, uh, people will start receiving their Pebbles. Okay, all right, cool. Yeah. So could you show us some of the actual features of Pebble, because you brought a lot of them Cool. Here. Yeah, absolutely. So I'm going to show off the orange colored Pebble here. So one of the coolest things is uh, a clock-based uh, or a text-based watch face. It can do up to 30 frames per second, so the animations are really smooth. Uh, but you get a lot of watch faces in there. Could you show us how, how, so, how you change them? So you just have a UI here uh, with which you can scroll down and say you want uh, uh, an analog watch face instead. Cool. So you can do an analog watch face or um, you can do a binary watch face. If you're a real geek, then you can tell me what time it is based on that. That's pretty cool. Could you show us another feature, like maybe uh, playing some music because Absolutely. you want to use the watch as a remote? So here's the music control. My phone currently has some music playing. I'm not sure if you can hear it, but it's playing Dylan. Uh, so you can change the track. So that was me changing the track. You can go back or you can pause and replay it. Okay. So that's really cool considering the Pebble is also waterproof. So it could be one of those situations where your phone's in your dock and yeah. in your shower you're changing your track while yeah, you're Yeah, that, that's a great, great uh, scenario. All right. Uh, and besides all of that, there's also the core functionality of uh, receiving SMS messages, uh, emails, and caller ID. Okay. Thank you so much for this introduction. Awesome. Thank you.